Good morning, class. I'm going to show you what to do for math today. Bill wanted to join for math. I want to show you what to do for math today. And what you need to do is you need to skip count. So you can usually count by ones, one, two, three, four, five, but you can also skip count by other numbers, by twos maybe you learned in kindergarten or first grade, two, four, six, eight, ten. In second grade, you can skip count by bigger numbers, like fives, tens, hundreds. So that's what we're going to practice today in our math workbook number two. And remember, there's not class today, so we're going to do it now, and then tomorrow we'll review it. Okay? Well, look who's here. Look who's here for math. Okay, let's see if we can read the directions. If we move the cat a little bit. It says, use the number line to skip count <laughs> by five, starting at zero. Write the two missing numbers and describe the pattern you see. So this is kind of like pattern making like we did last week. And we're on page four, 547. So page 547 in math workbook number two. And it says start at zero and skip count by five. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna start at zero. Five, 10, 15, 20. This one's gonna be 25. 30. So the pattern that I see is going up by fives, or I could say plus five pattern. Okay. Now let's look at page 548. At the top, it says you can skip count by fives. 400, 405, 410, 415, 420, 425, 430. And the pattern in the ones that you go is zero, five, zero, here I'll just underline it, zero, five, zero, five, zero, five, zero, five, zero. This one is skip counting by a hundred. So 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 1,000. And it says, I see a pattern in the hundred digit. So do I. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten. Okay. So, this one says, how could you use the number line in the first box above to skip count by tens starting at 100? So, if I was going to skip count by tens, I'm going to get a different color marker. I would skip the fives. So, I would do every other one. So, I'd go 400, 410. 420, 430. So I'm skipping the middle number, which is the five. 405, 415, 425. So now it says number one, skip count on the number line. Write the missing numbers. So. I'm already noticing that it's going up by tens. It's going up by tens. That doesn't mean that every number line is going to go up by tens. It means that this number line is going up by tens. So I'm going to write in the numbers that they've kind of printed here. My cat is biting me. Don't bite. That's not nice. And then I'm going to skip count. 600, 610, 620, 630, 640, 650, 660, 670, 680. Down here, it's not going by tens. It's not going by tens. 100 something, 300. Do you see what it's going by? Hopefully you notice that it's going by 100s. So I'm going to fill it in. Less, a hundred less than a hundred is zero. So it starts at zero. A hundred, two hundred, three hundred, four hundred, five hundred, six hundred, 
700, 800. You guys are good at patterns, so you should be good at counting. You're gonna work on this page by yourself. 549, okay? There's some where you skip count. You'll have to figure out what you're going by. There's some that you find the pattern like we were doing last week. And then these are a little bit tricky. These are a little bit tricky. See if you can do it and we'll talk about it tomorrow in class, but just see if you can do these. It's a little brain teaser. What do you think, Math Cat? Can they do it? Can they do it, Math Cat? Yes, they can. <laughs> okay, see you tomorrow in class, friends.